Hey everyone, it's Chris here to talk about Jughead Volume 1 uh, by Chip Zdarsky and the art is by Erica Henderson. Uh, I, while I'm saying that, I will say I really love the artwork in this. Just gonna start off by saying that, it's great. Uh, this is, Jughead's probably one of my like, favorite characters in Archie Comics. And I really like the new Jughead from the new Archie Comics, so I'm really happy that they gave him his little solo series, which I'm really excited about. Um, and Jughead's also an asexual character, which I don't know a lot of people know that, but he's asexual, and I thought the way it was addressed a couple of times in the comic was just really, really fantastic. I really love that. Um, so yeah, D this is like a story about Jughead essentially taking on the new administration of the school because they're changing some things that he doesn't uh, agree to. And there's a lot of fantasy sequences in Jughead. There's a lot of fantasy sequences in Archie in general, but I feel like there's more in the Jughead volumes to me. I don't know. Maybe. But yeah, there's like fantasy sequences, which were not always my thing, but I still enjoyed them. I really like the Super Team sequence and the Game of Thrones one. There's like a Game of Thrones one that I think some people like, but I wasn't completely about it because I really don't get the Game of Thrones thing. But yeah, there's a Game of Thrones like fantasy sequence in here. That was really cool. And I just really loved it. I thought it was a very fun read. I thought it was just very humorous, like you want Archer Comics to be. Um, and I really enjoyed it a lot. I'm really excited for the next volume, which comes out next year. A lot of the issues are already out. I'm probably going to read some of the issues before the full volume comes out next year, to be honest. Because I really want to read the crossover with Sabrina the Teenage Witch, which I'm going to be reading soon. The Chilling Adventures of Sabrina. I'm super excited to read that. Um, but yeah, I really, really enjoyed this and definitely recommend you go check out the Jughead comics. Um, and also, just for, for asexual character representation in the comic, that's really, really awesome. I know a lot of people are like, there are not enough asexual characters out there in um, media and literature, and this is an, an asexual character that is probably one of my favorite characters separate from that before that we even found that out. So, yeah. Uh, I'm excited to read more of this. I really do think I'm gonna not be able to hold out until the f next volume of, like, second volume comes out in 2017. I think I'm gonna get all of the individual issues, uh, with Christmas money. It might happen. We're gonna try not to do that, but it might happen. Uh, but yeah, I hope you have read the Jughead comics, uh, the new Jughead comics, and let me know in the comments what you thought about them down below. If you want to recommend any more comics to me, please do. I've been reading a little bit, a, few, a lot more comics in the second half of this year, and I'm really enjoying them. So, yeah, if you have any comics to recommend me, tell me those down below as well, and I will see you all in my next video.